Send a bikini pic to your crush. I'm going to send the picture and then I'll show you who it is. This seems a bit unhinged, actually. I'm going to show you who it is. Shut the f*** <laughs> up. Chloe, what is going on? Chloe, what is going on? <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Chloe vs Wild. Now before we get into this, two things. I am ill, okay? Aww. So thank me for being here. I don't sound like Excuses my normal chat. <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not in the mood. Don't touch me <laughs> and secondly, I know my tapes are hanging out and getting them done on the weekend. I've been too ill to do that. Anyway, this week I'm so excited because they're probably the busiest people in the industry. I say That's that every right. week, but they've actually been the hardest ones <laughs> to pin down. But I don't care, they could have cancelled one more time and I would have been okay Because I'm such big fans, it is the host of the Useless Hotline, Max and George! Ooh, what an introduction! I know, that, that was really good, Chloe. Yeah. I like that. I always that. get people in a good mood before I start yeah. them off. Thank you. Awful Thank thing. you very much. Are you ill, by the way? You've not, you've not said. You haven't mentioned. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, near me. Gonorrhea of the throat. I Ooh. wish it was gonorrhea. Oh, right. I okay. think I'm abstinent. Interesting. Right. So the word oh. abstinent. Yeah, one of them. One of Absinthe. them. Absinthe. Absinthe. That's what. Abs that's what you've been doing. <laughs> no, this is what we did on your podcast, yeah. and you just kept using <laughs> massive words. Not good. Like, yeah, I am. I don't think this is. I'm going through it. The he just bullshits his way through yeah, life. Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. Thank you very much for coming. Thank you for having us, Chloe. Oh my God, the you and I wrote a list of names, and you guys were right at the top. No, oh, wow. stop it. Oh my God. So it took you a while to reach out, but you know. I mean, I've got a warner. I don't know about you. I can see someone popping up in them joggers. That would be my massive blow. Now I'll probably right. get it out of yeah, yeah, that's fine. And point it right at George. I've, I've oh, mine into the waistband. Right, that's always a good, a good method. That's good what strat. boys do, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. In the waistband. Yeah. Does yours reach the waistband though? Uh, no, I've, I've got a secondary waistband. George, I've seen it. I've seen it. Picture like. No. <laughs> kind of, I would describe it as like a mound of flesh, kind of like. That's disgusting. Like it's very. Oh my god, it's very. Could be girthy. mistaken for a third nipple. Oh, yes. Yeah. I don't very, like very wide. Picture like a tuna can. Like two inches long, like eight inches wide. And the smell. Yeah, wow. really weird. How much foreskin have you got? Barely sure. any. It's, honestly, it's, it's not even there. <laughs> How much foreskin does that have you got, actually? Like, not a lot at all. It's, it's quite alarming, actually. You should get that sorted. Yeah, out. Is this what you two are like day to day? I yeah. feel like the vibe I get on social media is that you just wreak havoc everywhere. Absolutely. He kind of runs off. I'm just like, damaged oh, no, control. That is so yeah. accurate. Is it? That is so accurate. Like, I literally was just telling you before, I was planning to originally do the podcast by myself. Yeah. But then I was like, that would just be absolute, like, mm. ridiculous. I'm just the first line of defence. Yes, you are. Yeah. 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 yeah, you're like his PR man a little bit. I am. Literally, I like, you really shouldn't be saying that. <laughs> no, what I mean, he's not. means what? by that is. Yeah, yeah <laughs> later, almost. Mm. Yeah. So you guys have been kind of, I feel like every single time I open any app, you guys are just doing something new. Well, we have many positions, don't we? Oh, we usually like start do. with doggy. Yeah. yeah, I mean, that's just classic. Um, um, and then yeah, when we get into the apps, what do The reverse do? butterfly. The What's reverse that? butterfly? That's like, so, like, do you know when people do the butterfly swimming? Yeah. So you basically mimic that on your back whilst gasping for breath. Um, Where are your legs? It's up in the yeah, air. Yeah, literally. Wait, why are your arms doing that? Just for fun. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What? Just to get the momentum <laughs> going. <laughs> 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 Just to get it going. Is yeah. it like a mood of transport as well? Yeah, I, was, I mean, it could be. It Maybe could it does the like rhythm. That. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Did you do that at your recent live show? Congratulations. <laughs> right. Look at it. Look what at a that segue that is. What a segue. I knew that was coming up. I knew the bad one was coming. No, we didn't actually. Because um, it was 16 plus and we mm. thought, unless they're over 18, I don't want to get my genitals out for them. That's yeah. a good muscle to have. Also, you've got that restraining order. 100%, oh, yeah. I know, 16 year old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Um, no, but seriously, the live show was amazing. It was I good fun. Was it good yeah. fun? Yeah. 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 Honestly, nervous? do it. Like, no, when you I get the chance. No, I promise you. So, like, I was stressing out. I'm, I'm no, a stresser. Yeah. I'm very much not a stresser. George is I'm, like... if anything, like, so not stressed that it stresses him out. Yeah. Oh, that <laughs> would annoy me. Be annoyed at the same level as me. Oh, my God. I am so... I overthink every single but detail I'm, I'm about at, everything. I'm good at, like, calming you down. 100%. Like, oh, I, will, I will ring you and I'll be like, George, this, this, this and this. And he'll be like, Max, what the fuck are you worried about? Like, we've done this. This is going well. What you want about? And I'm like... He's right, oh my God. Mm. <laughs> yeah. um, so like when it came to the live show, I wanted every aspect of it to be like planned out from start to finish. George, I remember when I first brought it up to him, he was like, 
let's just like get on stage and do what we do on the podcast. And I was like, George, <laughs> I don't have a no. heart attack. <laughs> I was like, these people are buying tickets, George. This is different. They're not just watching That's us in their bedroom. I, did, I, I didn't say, like, let's just do the podcast. No, but, but, you, no, like, but yeah, you were more yeah. a lot more chilled about it, which yeah. is, I am like an extra level of over-preparedness. Like, yeah. I want things to look like it's chill and like easy when people are watching it. Yeah. And not have them know that behind the scenes, I was stressing out for weeks over it mm. and over planning oh, everything. Bless you. Um, but I literally got on stage and I was like, everything's out of my control now. Like, we'll just go with it. And really? he, exactly. he was amazing. Oh, I was amazing. That. I was so good. Oh, but how good. good was I? No. <laughs> um, yeah, no, you were really good. And you were right. Thank you. How long did you prepare for it? Because I saw you did a roast. Did that just, was that mm. off the tongue or? No, <laughs> was that, it for? No. Was it, was it not? I, I, like, this is a perfect example. I think George did <laughs> his job. Jokes, no exaggeration the night before. Yeah. I prepared mine. I prepared mine whilst we were in Tokyo. Every now and then we'd just be talking and he'd go. <laughs> I was like, oh I hate this about you. Like, which just is so much worse. Yeah. Literally, like I I started probably about two months in advance, like mm. just writing the jokes. Because I knew that I would not be as good at it as George. So I was like, I need yeah, to prepare. Um, and really? I feel like I did. I did all right. I like. I was proud of myself. I thought yours yeah. were funnier. Thank you, Chloe. Thank you. Did you good. say funnier? Yeah, she did. I think they're about the same. No, she it's said cool. funnier, George. She did. Actually, oh, yeah. funnier. Yeah. Um, Not sure. But yeah, like the show itself, it's it took a lot of preparation, especially because this was it's a big like, venue. Yeah, and it was a one-off show mm. in hopes that like, well, we were we were toying with the idea of doing like maybe a tour or something like that. But we didn't know, number one, if we'd enjoy doing a live show. Number two, if people would... <laughs> so we are definitely not doing that. <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> number two, if people would even enjoy watching us or if people would want to come. Yeah. So we were like, obviously, mm. it's one thing having viewers of your podcast or listeners, but having, like, selling tickets to a show is very different. A whole mm. different ball game, I guess. Is it? Yeah. 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 Was it hard? Or... No. Oh, I I... Mean... <laughs> <laughs> no, it was actually really easy. No, it's yeah. It's fucking <laughs> No, I mean, like... We were sh I was shocked anyway, because we kind of got... Because my sister asked me to try to get a ticket because it was sold out. Oh, well, yeah. I forgot to ask you. That's right. Don't <laughs> um... I don't want her to see yeah. that shit. You yeah. tried very hard. Imagine, can I have a ticket? Not for me. I don't want to come at all. Um, I literally couldn't think of anything worse. But um, no, I mean, we kind of got ourselves into a bit of a situation because the whole idea of doing this live show was to see the demand for maybe doing a tour in the future. Yeah. And we didn't get told by the company that we were doing the live show with that the tickets were going on sale until the day before. So we were, we were supposed to be told a month mm. in advance and they just forgot to tell us. So we couldn't so even we... put it in an episode, could we? So it was literally just Instagram Appreciate stories that guys, sold it. Please yeah. buy yeah. it. By the way, um, I know that like some of you might listen to our podcast. Um, we're also doing a live show tomorrow. Like, <laughs> please come. come on, literally, so it's like, fuck. Um, so thankfully we did end up selling out, which I was shocked at because you know, you would think if you were doing a tour or a live show for Chloe vs. The World, then you would announce it first in an episode so that the yeah. people don't watch. And even then, not sell out. Yeah, mm. because no one gives a fuck. I, that's why I wouldn't do it. I don't like public speaking, and I swear to God. Or like someone who really hates me would buy all the tickets and it would be fucking oh, empty. No, I think you'd, uh, you'd really enjoy it. Genuinely, like, you, I feel like if you, you'd think I would have been like, I'd hate it, but it was mm. actually I feel like really you did fun. quite a lot of stuff in crowds, like you did the Sidemen Rose, and that's a lot of pressure, like, Mm. That was Even one of your first ever things, though, wasn't it? Yeah, that was, and that, was, millions, that was like four what, five, days six before. Six million end. people say that. No, no, no that was That's like more a, what, than a week people before. People watch Love Island, yeah. Like. Crazy. Yeah, but they, it was just them. Yeah, right. it was them. It was them and Carol. Other people would think, right? Even though it's just this, yeah. I've still, it's still going to be broadcast. That's no, how like you shift TV. That. I was, yeah. I was more scared for the roast than I was for. Yeah, I mean that made, for the yeah. talent show. Not the roast, the yeah. talent show. Yeah, yeah. I mean they that made sense. Out. I roasted them at the start and they cut it out. Oh, bastards! Oh, mm. so sorry. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you must have a really hard life. Yeah. Um, yeah. No, I was very impressed with how well you did though, because he'd never done anything like other than. Like you're college. like a proud mm. mum. I am. He's yeah. no, I know. He, keep, he keeps saying this. Your, ma your, your manager came over to me at the mm. after party and went, I'm so happy with how you did. And then I was like, oh, thanks. And she goes, because I, I thought you might crumble. To be fair, I thought the same. That's why, I mean, I made us do an acting class beforehand. What on earth? Yeah. Um, so not an yeah, acting class. It was like some sort of like TV show. Like, yeah. Where you do all so the we, bits we literally like hired a performance expert who mm. came You're, and taught us. Oh, that was really sweet. Purely because I knew that I'd done, like, George, as, as, as we just said, is so laid back that I would ask him, like, 
do you feel confident about this? Like you've never done like public speaking to a crowd before. Are you sure you'll be all right? He was like, yeah. So I was like, fuck, what does that mean? I was like, what does just yes mean? Why do you shrug your shoulders? Like what's going on? So I was like, right, we're going to hire um, a performance expert who's going to come and teach us techniques. And to be fair, it was she very was there for useful. like an hour and genuinely it was like the most like mental, th it was so good. So uh, useful. Have you done yeah. media training? Yeah, I have. Yeah. He's not again, so no. I was panicked about yeah. that. Like, I, I do? don't need music training. No, as much I do. As you do. <laughs> no, but I'll, I'll, you everybody yeah. needs it, but Max needs it. I do. I absolutely <laughs> do. I feel like that's why people love you because you've got loose lips. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. I mean, you've seen my porn. I um, have seen clearly. them. Yeah, they are um, very but, fucking loose. No, no, absolutely. <laughs> um, but yeah, I couldn't agree more. Like, I sometimes forget, even now, like it's just us three sat here. Not thinking hundreds of thousands of people are going to see this. Maybe um, just a couple of thousand. Yeah, yeah, a couple of hundred. He's fucking um, serious. It's this really is a dusty big as well. Show. <laughs> it's absolutely fucking. Honestly, if you can see what's happening round here. I am it's a host, not fucking vile. cleaner. I've never said come to my really clean set. <laughs> yeah. I'll just turn up here as long as this isn't that bad. I don't care. We can tell. Fuck off. Um, but yeah, I was so proud watching him do the side men. Um, can you just stop speaking speak to me like I'm your son? <laughs> yeah, he doesn't speak to mute. Yeah. <laughs> it's really yeah. Brilliant. No, you did really well. Very Do you think it's crazy that you've come from TikToks? Well, did you have a plan when you started TikTok? Like, come nope. on, I'm going to be an influencer. Chloe, does it look no, like my a plan was... looks very strategic. <laughs> I yeah, about yeah. two and a half years, maybe two years down the line, I'll end up sat across from Chloe Burrows on mm -hmm. the show that she's going to produce in the future. Ah. And I was like, that's the plan. See, yeah. I just wanted to be inside Here of Chloe. People maybe. didn't even know me then as well, so that's exactly. good. Yeah, that wow. Is good. That is crazy. I'm just good my But you've only process. been in it longer than me. Only I a few months. Because I watched YouTube before Love Island, Yeah, but actually. like, I'd say we... Yeah. Yes. Because yeah. I, I, remember, I remember when Chloe came out, and she followed me and I was yeah. like, oh my God, Chloe, Chloe Burrows follows me from Love Island. Because that was the first ever season of Love Island that I'd ever watched. Oh yeah, you said. So to me, Archive, you, were literally literally like, <laughs> you were literally like queen of Love Island because I'd never seen anybody else. So I was like, is Chloe true. is the best contestant that there's ever been. <laughs> and then you followed me and I was telling all my friends, I was like, Chloe Burrows follows me. Um, oh, and they were like, we don't give a fuck, she's dead. No, I'm joking. No, no I'm joking. <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> no. Um, but yeah, like we, I guess came up in terms of like followers and like actually working in the industry. Cause what month did you go into Love Island? Wow. June, 2021. June. So I, I mean, I started to get, I think I hit a million followers in June. So that That's was like- so many though. So it was literally, oh, it's mental. I hit a million like a year later. Yeah, cause no one gives a fuck mm. about you, George. <laughs> oh my God. Well, in June, I think literally. I was I was on like 200 and something K. Yeah. Oh, I was one of them. Yeah. Oh, this is followed by of you. Oh, oh, thank Islanders. you, love. Thank thank you. God. But yeah, it is. It's absolutely wild. And the way that I describe it is because I worked full time at the time where I was getting. Even when where I had a million, work? I worked at L'Oreal, which is a bit esteemed. Um, don't even know everyone allowed to say that. I'm sure I am. That's yeah, a really I'm hard grad team to get into. Oh my God. I got rejected. I feel like they wouldn't want to associate themselves with me, but I actually work with them now, so it's all good. Okay. Um, but like, what a full circle moment. So I, I literally was an intern for a year. Oh. And um, during that internship, I had TikTok, but nobody at my work knew. And I was gaining all these followers, but nobody knew. And I never even wanted or thought about earning any money from social media until I hit a million followers, which is crazy. Are you fucking I speak... serious? 20K, I'd be like, where's it, the money? There you go. Like, I didn't even, it didn't even cross my mind. Like, I didn't earn anything until I left my internship. And I remember the weekend my internship ended, I got signed to a management and then I got my first ever brand deal. And what I already was your had... first brand deal? Oh my God, it was like this, like scooter, um, <laughs> electric scooter. I remember this, it's and... so weird. Oh. You had a little helmet on. Oh you? my God. <laughs> That was the most painful experience of my life. I remember I had an existential crisis whilst filming it because I was like, I'm actually not enjoying myself. And I'm, <laughs> and I'm promoting that you should be enjoying these scooters. And then I thought, oh my God, am I a sellout? Am I a sellout? But I was like, I've also just ended my job and I have no money. I've so I was like, do you Get know what? Get me on that fucking Even, scooter. Literally. Yeah. So I was like, woo! Yeah! <laughs> what was like, your first ad, George? Um, I was just going to go, you Mark. My first brander was... Um, <clears throat> you well, did it for the Conservative Party, didn't you? Yeah, no, yeah. Big Dojo got in uh, contact yeah. with that. I'm joking. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> so I'm so unethical. I'm joking. I'm joking. I was in so bad. George, we want you to... <laughs> I did. What was it? I think it was like... Uh, some food, oh, it's gorillas. I love oh, gorillas. Yeah, yeah. Some, in yeah. London, I use it all the time. Yeah, yeah. Like, like delivery or something. Yeah, yeah. like yes. just made, um, but 
Uh, I, it didn't actually deliver to my area, so they just they sent me some bags, and then I went to buy them some food and put it in the you're bag. A joke. So you're a fraud oh, like yeah. me. We're both frauds. Yeah, yeah we are. Yeah. Have I done a fraud? Look, I can say that. That's fine. You're that was ages ago. Yeah. Have you ever yeah. done a sex toy one? No, I wouldn't oh, do okay, that. No. no. Yeah. I don't even use sex toys. No, I've not. Why did you? St- <laughs> you made it no, like I, you had. I think, <laughs> no, <laughs> I've never done that. No. I never would. I never would. No. Would you ever? No, I don't. What think do you so. think is the rude? Oh shit! If I, What's the rudest thing you would do? The, the rudest, rudest thing. thing. Like, Are we yeah, still talking brand Tell my mum to <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what the rudest thing I would do. <laughs> Tell my mum she's a fucking slag. Um, what do you mean? What's the rudest thing you would do? <laughs> What's like the naughtiest thing you guys would do? <laughs> Just like spin the ball. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I did a Durex one. <laughs> yeah, like we I guess that's. Them. But it was to promote that. So it was very like um, they they brought out different sizes of condoms and they wanted well, like a comedic. God. Yeah, no, thank Innovative. God. It's, it's you like down time. It? This one's too big. Pretty much. Yeah. Ah. Um, I did like a comedic video and the money was good, so I was like, do you know what? Yeah. I'll do it, Joe. Nice. I'll have it. Yeah. Money talks. Exactly. At the end I'm pretty of the sure they got in contact with me before and said, "You're gifting." Yes. Oh, they gift shitloads <laughs> yeah. of condoms. Oh, you're, yeah. you're not shagging anyone. So oh, what's like, the point? Well, that's that? such a weird oh, thing you. to get gifted. What do you put it on your story? Like. Thanks, Jurex. Yeah, literally. Thanks, Jurex. Hashtag horny. Yeah. Hashtag <laughs> um, it was Pride shortly after, and I gave um, everyone condoms when they left oh. my house. It was great. Nice. Who I don't was really at your house? Used them. Oh, um, to like pair on three keys in the bar yeah. taking condoms or something. Joe Bags was, I think I threw a handful of condoms at him. He didn't use them, the dirty bastard. Bless him. He Just is filth. Joe for not even surprising <laughs> to me. Oh, he's filth. He is filth. I think oh. that's why I like him, though, because yeah. he's absolutely disgraceful. You said you don't use them. Well, because I'm in a relationship and I can't get pregnant. It's not like I'm... I mean, yet, well, we keep pregnant. trying, but we'll see. <laughs> You know? I just did a TikTok the other day of like a man, I don't know where he was, but he was pregnant. But it was clearly fake, oh. and all the comments oh. were like, wow, amazing. I was like, oh. That's a really interesting story. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I told that on this What's podcast. the rudest thing that you ever said? What's the fuck on gun? What do you mean, that? And you know you always will be watching this. I was telling Max, my mum like, doesn't use social media. If I showed you her Instagram, oh my god, it's so funny, I should actually show you. But she like takes a picture of like her plate and she's like, happy Easter, like shit. She did that the other day. Oh. Or they were in the garden, she just took a picture of like the corner of the flower bed. Happy Sunday. Oh. Mommy, this- she is Max's biggest fucking fan. I mean, uh-huh. she's very intelligent. Um, she's is, got a what's problem. her name? Louisa. Louisa. Oh Louisa my gosh, Rachel. the most intelligent woman. Louisa versus the world. That's what I'm waiting to see. Fuck off. <laughs> she's All right. Fuck <laughs> 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 Not about Louisa. Kay. You guys do your dilemmas on your show, so it's probably only right. Seeing as you're obviously the connoisseurs of advice. Oh shit. Please okay. get some dilemmas in up. here. Right, brilliant. Ex fan dilemmas. Oh, okay. is that a point? No. X fans. X fans. What are they writing in? What? <laughs> I used to like Chloe. You just like a more mark on the face if I read it. X fan. Right, number one. Mm-hmm. Are you ready? Like. I was born ready. Okay, perfect. Nice. Do you do like rude dilemmas on your body? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Because what is the rudest thing you're doing? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> no, can I tell you one that we got that we had to cut? We might even have to cut it from here. Because it was oh, so... No, you one? don't have to cut it. Oh, no, no, it was no, so... It's, it's, no, oh, my it's gosh. Bad. So, oh, really? Yeah. yeah, so in case we're not making sense, one time on our podcast, The Useless Hotline, um, we got a dilemma sent in where somebody enjoyed being shat into. So they wanted... Used as a toilet. So they wanted somebody to up. open no their asshole... No, I don't and like it. ...who inside of them so they're like fantasy they in fact they, they'd carried out this fantasy yeah. where they got um i can't remember what the device is called but it's meant to like open up like animals to help them give birth so like it's like a Hands. metal thing that like clamps the that taxidermy what yeah the fuck? clamps them open and this person had it inside of them in their ass had made a custom toilet seat on a chair where men would it's a lot come, of work, custom toilet seat. Yeah, men yeah. would come and story. shit into the asshole. I felt ill. Yeah, and they said to us, didn't they? They yeah. were like, we had to not keep it in because they weren't even just saying like, is this crazy? They were like, I'm concerned because my doctor is telling me that my health is at risk, but mm. I can't stop doing it. Well, they didn't. It wasn't just like in and out. It was like it laid in there dormant. They no, were like, I feel so ill. It was yeah. like Stop they would just like keep like looking after it, like a little kangaroo in its pouch. Oh, and I'd be then, sick. Then one day it. 
comes out again, it's a whole new breed. Dirty I, little bastard. Imagine, it. imagine oh, pooing out someone else's poo. Oh, I'll be so... <laughs> and the word that they actually used was that they like, to, they like to have it in there to cook. And I'm thinking, <laughs> this ain't a microwave meal, you dirty bastard. Anymore, they didn't even give, this like, is vile behaviour. Fan 180, 30 minutes, I think it was. Oh, dirty, dirty bastard. I mean, mm. sorry. That's I'm... got to be the worst thing I've ever heard. Yeah, not to kink shame, Bad, but that is fucking great. <laughs> Who fucking sent that in? Because put their picture up, that's yeah, right. No, I think Talia was on. It was on yes, Talia's Talia, episode. Yeah. And she was like, what the fuck is this podcast? I can't oh, help God. that dilemma. It's not even the dilemma. I know. No. Like, that's what we were saying. How do we help you? That's not something we can do. Your doctor is telling you your life is at risk and you're still letting people shit inside of you. <laughs> Is that a true story? Yes, yes. no, I promise, Is I it promise true? it's true. We literally we got a max. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> What's the rudest thing you've ever done? That. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was, oh, it was so grim, yeah. It's real, sadly. Oh. So yeah, so that's the worst one. I don't got. like that one. No, I don't either. No, that's I mean, I don't know what you were expecting. You said the, it wasn't the that. worst. It yeah. yeah, was not that. Okay, <laughs> oh. move on. No, I don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm having... Oh, fucking funny that you lot write this one in. <laughs> I'm having sex with my boss. Oh. Getting loads of perks, but I'm not enjoying it. Do I continue? I mean, absolutely. Well, surely absolutely. no, if oh. you're not enjoying it. <laughs> right, so this is where we differ. Um, but if you're not enjoying it, what's, what's the point? <laughs> I mean, literally at the live show... you're not, not enjoying it! I think she means not enjoying the sex, but she's enjoying yeah. the perks. So why are you doing it, the sex? Oh. Yeah. So getting the you're perks. not enjoying it is what, what is the no. fucking point? I mean, we've all been there, let's be honest, where like maybe you're getting paid a couple hundred quid and what? Okay, it's maybe going not. On. Oh, sorry. Um, anyway, <laughs> who said that? What? Chloe versus the world. This is crazy. Yeah. Uh, no, I mean, if I, I've definitely had, I mean, I've had sex with a lot of people, just putting it out there. Yeah, a lot. For <laughs> yes, a hell of a lot. <laughs> you and, play uh, zombies a different way to what I do. And, uh, but, oh, when I was single, I was a mess. Really? An absolute weapon. Here we are. Um, <laughs> but horrible, horrible vibes all around. And we weren't enjoying it. Oh, I mean, I yeah, but what, you weren't no, getting, but like, you weren't, like, you were enjoying that. That's not, you weren't getting you perks. No, but there were definitely some points where... The STDs count, don't count as perks. <laughs> no. No, um, they're not free treats. No, just an add-on bonus. Um, add-on boner. I, oh, God. <laughs> and um, I feel like sometimes <laughs> I would definitely... I don't know what I'm doing. Boner joke. Boner. <laughs> No, yeah, I would I definitely know. have points where I was like, I'm not even enjoying this, but I've got here now. Can't be asked anymore, but I'm yeah, as well. Would you see that person again if the sex was shit? No, no, no yeah. that is true. Fair so enough. So what, what is the point you're making here? If I was getting perks Just such as... Out. By the way, I used to shag loads, <laughs> no, so... But if I was getting perks such as, like, especially in your job, like, added money, added bonuses, I would definitely so carry on. You're a glorified on. escort, essentially. Nothing yeah. glorified about it. You're just yeah. a prostitute. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the idea that someone would want to pay me to have sex with them is wild, first of all. I think I'd be flattered. I look like a bowl of milk. Oh, stop. You look like a bowl of milk? Have you ever tried fake Chloe, I've got it on right now. Can you don't tell in, in, this, in amongst the hair? I have no idea. I am the same colour as this you. Is how can I just say, he's one of the hairiest people I actually really know. You can see your reflection in my wrist. <laughs> look at he's that. so hairy. Hairy. You wouldn't expect that from it. He can grow, like, this is like hours of I shaved growth. about two hours ago. But he grows hair like- I've got pubes <laughs> down to my knees. Like if, you, if, you, if we gave him like two weeks, I, I guarantee he'd grow like a full beard. I literally would become a rug, human rug. Really? I, um, what's it called? Cream? What? What's the cream? You cream? Hair no, removal. We, don't do that story. No. My ha hair removal, Apparently my whole your, body. Um, Sink is clogged, put hair removal cream in it. Oh, that's a good idea. Bless it. Wow, yeah. That's a good way to get us away from that conversation. <laughs> yeah, and um, quick, uh, use up. Mr. Muscle. <laughs> yeah, yeah, please fucking clean your thing, please. Clean your fucking thing. Um, I mean, right, so advice for this person, I'm guessing we probably have different. As long as they're not fucking hairy, set yes, that in. Yes, absolutely. So that's right. Um, in my opinion, keep going, get as much out of it as you can. Blackmail where possible, take pictures. So maybe um, <laughs> just keep going, keep going for it. Normally I can always like have these conversations and just deal with it, but I'm actually just sat back and doing live on this one. I don't know what to fucking say. What's your advice? Uh, if you're not enjoying it, stop. I wouldn't continue Boring. having sex That's what everyone does with me. It. Yeah. Usually after the well, first usually couple seconds. Well, usually they don't even start. 
If you're not enjoying it, help them get better at sex. Okay, and how would you do that? Turn into their boss. I mean, you're yeah. the sex boss. Ooh, They're be the money the boss. Sex oh. boss. Yeah. Be the sex <laughs> boss in that situation. That's a good idea. What would you do then? So let's let's role play. Well, we don't know what was wrong with the sex. Well, let's role play. Um, so I approach, I approach you, Chloe. <laughs> Um, well, who am I, the boss? No, I'm your boss. And I'm saying, right, okay, Chloe. <laughs> Please take away. <laughs> Chloe, um, you've, yeah. been yes, under Daddy? you've been underperforming recently. Under you or under um, you? Well, let's let's keep this straight. Oh, wait, I'm shit sex. No, you're fucking shit sex. It's the boss. Yes, I've yeah, got yeah. to tell you. No, yeah, let's, let's, let's stop keep this. this. I, was, I was getting somewhere then. Carry um, on. <laughs> let's keep this strictly professional, <laughs> you dirty little slag. Um, sorry, that just like slipped out. Pretty sure Maybe I've seen I could, this one um, Punch me in my face. No, you can't say that. Maybe I could slip it in sometime. Maybe in my um, arse album. Yeah. Would you like a bonus? Where Are we in like, the staff I've, room at this point? Where is this conversation we are, happening? We are. We are indeed. I do not um, know where it's coming from. Yeah, the kettle's it's coming. The kettle's right. um, the kettle's pretty hot over there. Do you know Will what else is hot? Anybody eat my my cheese sandwich? <laughs> Please be quiet. You put fired. a label on that. You're fired. You're fired. Um, I'm trying to seduce this young lady right here. Um, no, you... I need to talk to you in the bedroom. Because you Why are. Why does nobody understand? It says George upset. Cheese Sandwich for right, a reason. Please, sir, you're, you're fired. You're fired. Leave. Leave. I'm wet. I mean, she's wet. <laughs> Anybody got a wet floor? Go and get a wet floor sign. All right, she's dripping. Anyway. Um, you don't hate my sex. I hate your you sex. You hate my sex, but I'm I'm the financial dominator. Oh, um, okay. So, I d see. So, did you like it when I um, put my face right in your vagina the other day? Yeah, this is my small God, problem. You wouldn't even be able to tell that you're gay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, it was a bit, I, it got all frothy down there. Is everything okay? I've got an STD. From you. From me? Oh, God. From you. That's um, such the point. So well, when your was... face was down there and you're yeah. in there, and the was, aim isn't I... to get the whole area wet and cold. Oh. Look for the fucking G-spot and just penetrate. Oh, my God. So I shouldn't have brought that <laughs> 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 Dickhead. <laughs> oh dear. Um, um, right, well, I'll keep my ice pack at home next time. I thought that you liked that. No. Um, and whilst we're at it, your rhythm. Rhythm? Is not getting me. Rhythm okay. is not going to get me. Right, well, I have. Because you know where you just go. Well, I like to. I like to boring, they, they call, boring. They call me the machine. Boring. Gun. Okay. Um, wow, well, you're getting sacked. Uh, how'd you like that? Are you going to put up with my bad lovemaking? Or do you want no, a bonus? No, it was bad. I loved it. This I is, want a bonus. This is gone. You want a bonus? Very All right bonus. then. Okay, in and well, around my paycheck. Meet me in meet him in meet me in the um, <laughs> office me, later, me. and I'll I'll put it in your vagina. So you fucking should. I yeah. don't know how much I like this conversation. This Have is... you found your cheese sandwich, by the way? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Go <laughs> back to work now. No, I've been, been munching on a ham sandwich all morning. <laughs> oh, that's disgusting. Oh my Australian. god, gammon. Foul gammon. Absolute gammon. So that problem solved. <laughs> yeah. Take. Be the sex boss, just like I was, yes. and fucking find his cheese sandwich. Ab yeah. Absolutely. Right, oh, that's next a nice one. <laughs> find his cheese sandwich. Oh. Cheese, Fine. cheese, cheese. <laughs> <laughs> what just happened there? What was, what was cheese, that? cheese, cheese, cheese. <laughs> Are you mentally all right, love? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Cheese, cheese, cheese. You looked at me. Because he said cheese. Cheese. You looked at me as if you were so saying oh a proper God. sentence. <laughs> cheese, cheese, cheese. Fucking Wallace and Gromit over here. What's going on? Are you sure I'm not getting anything in it? I'm trying to you because you said... Cheese sandwich. <laughs> and I went to say cheese, it. Cheese, I kept cheese. trying to say it, but all that was coming out was cheese. The cheese, cheese, oh, cheese, cheese, cheese. All right. Awful, awful. Fuck that one up. Yeah, right. please. <laughs> I took my boyfriend of five years for dinner. He told me he's ah. Oh, he told me he's gay and has been shagging my cousin's boyfriend. What do I do? Right, first of all, <laughs> what is what is the other what other option is there? We just force him to stay with you? Like, yeah, yeah, forever. Um, you you're not gay, you're with me. <laughs> I mean there is conversion therapy, but I don't recommend that. Um no, it doesn't do work. That. We've tried it on George, it doesn't mm. work. Um yeah. well, you've tried it. Yeah. Many times. George, I want you to love me. Please. No, Max, oh, it's not how it works. God. Um, I'm not sure about that one. I think wow. First of all, five years and tells you at dinner, that's quite iconic. Um iconic. Iconic. Just I'm highly iconic. Um that's awful behaviour. If I, I mean, I had a girlfriend. Is it, is it awful? What, what, would you rather, rather have a text? What? Yeah. I think it's I think awful it's for the pleasant. boy. What? 
What? what the boy you? who's gay. Is that right? Why is it awful for him? Yeah. At dinner? No, it's awful for him to do it at dinner. Why? But why is it? Because, like, what the fuck? Tell, like, you're Where, in a public where's the, place. Okay, where's the ideal situation to do it? Maybe um, the car. Via text. <laughs> No, not in the no. same room, so dropping that they can't assault home. you. On, on a dropping off home, say, right? I know I'm dropping off you off at home. Um, I'm also homosexual. Yeah. Um, Have a nice, nice night. Yeah, a nice pun, maybe. Or you go in and you go, I've got three days to live. I'm on the edge, and um, I just want you to know that like we should really savor every moment. Joking, I'm just gay. It's fine. Oh, um, right. Don't worry about it. I'm still gonna live but I am deeply homosexual and I don't want to continue this relationship. That doesn't seem like the best way to do it. Oh, OK. I'm not really sure what the best way. I think, if yeah. me, maybe... Don't do Have it. you ever been with a gay <laughs> man? <laughs> Just don't do it. Have Stay you ever been with a gay man? Yes. No. Not that you know It's not like my gay best mate. Right, no, OK. Just cheeky fingers every now and again. But no. you, but if it, you were fingering him, so it's a bit... They're yeah, nails. Done Jesus that. Christ. Okay, how? They're quite oh, short my, at the moment. Oh, yeah, but short. They have been long. Yeah, oh. I wouldn't have that. I'd be no, right, so no, I'd please. Thank it. God. How is this where the conversation is going? sounded like gone. a threat. How is it not um, gone there? What I would it's say... <laughs> What I would say is, I mean, when I came out as gay, I had a girlfriend for... I have shocking information. That's crazy. I know, right? Um, <coughs> I did have a girlfriend for over a year, but I came out like a year after we broke up, so I, I don't really have any Why advice. Why is this relevant, then? Just, I'm just making it about myself. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm OK, then. Never mind. I came out once. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> We're waiting no. for you to come out, George. Um... <laughs> Are you I think dinner's that now? Um, yeah, this is a safe space. I was waiting for this moment. Oh my god. <laughs> no. um, I think dinner's, oh. dinner's the. Why is dinner a bad place to do it? Because That's... it's public and you can't get mad. They're doing it to control the situation so that you can't start screaming. Because I would want to start screaming. If my boyfriend now why told me he was straight. There's nothing you can do. Just shake yeah. hands and be done with it. No, I think you guys are being too friendly. We had a good run. Yeah. I would. <laughs> five years. You've been with someone for five years. They not only tell you that they're gay, but they've been cheating on you with your brother. Oh, cheating. Oh, yeah, they've been cheating, cheating on as well. Yeah, that is no, awful behaviour. Don't do it, Dino. That is yeah. awful behaviour. Like, do I would dinner. lose my mm, shit. Yeah, I fucking yeah, would. Yeah, like, like, I'd go for the cousin's boyfriend. Yeah. You're all fucking gay. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. You're all gay. You are all gay. Gay people. Gay people attack. This is not good. I don't know where that came from. Um, <laughs> but yeah, not good. And um, I would say, oh, I'm, or I would pretend, oh, everything's, don't worry about it. Should we just go home and we can have a deep chat about it? But I'm okay get with it. Get in the car. And just... Get in the. Fuck off! Absolutely. Wow. Oh, yeah. oh my god. He does him. Yeah, oh, yeah verbal and physical abuse. Yeah. Yeah. We don't recommend that, obviously. Oh, I but... completely forgot about the cheating aspect. I'll be completely yeah. honest. Yeah, don't do it at dinner. Yeah, pitch it. Do it at home. And then we'll fight at home. I mean, and then I'll go to the next yard, fight him, and then be done with it. Imagine if Fuck someone off. cheated on you. I mean, this hard, like, you've never been in love. Nobody ever loves you. So... You've not been in love before. Um, I mean, it wasn't reciprocated, Chloe, but oh, was, we don't need to talk about it. Carry on. Oh, oh sorry. It's all sorry, good George. Now. We'll, we'll get through our issues one day. Um, yeah, basically, beat the shit out of them. Obviously, yeah. don't physically assault because that's yeah. bad. But if you need to, maybe do it. I don't know. I'm going to stop speaking. <laughs> your take from the situation is that uh, you're sad I about your I think just lover. have the same conversation, but in private. You don't. I, no hands need to be thrown. <gasps> no. Have you ever been cheated on? Well, it's quite difficult to be cheated on when you're not with someone, isn't it? <laughs> you know, I've not been with a partner before, sorry. No. Yeah. Yeah. I see. There you no, go. No, we're not. Not since like year nine. Oh, and we he, were both yeah. in year nine. You can't empathise then, because when someone cheats on you, the burning fucking rage yeah. that comes from within, and it stays with you well, for life. Well, he had to keep it quiet because obviously she was in year nine, but George was his current age, so he couldn't really, he couldn't I really go we into details. We were both details. in year nine. <laughs> oh, okay, we were family sorry. friends. We were both old. Right, sorry, right. Philip. Oh, that's really that. sweet. Um, so in that yeah. case, probably solve that one as well. Yeah. Take that one off. See you later then, darling. Next one. Oh my god, lol, I threw up from giving head all over his stomach. How do I recover? Oh my god, head? can relate. I've done this. I've fucking done it. Really? Yeah. We've had this dilemma sent into our podcast before. Yeah. Have you? I said. No, we actually was... sent this one together, didn't we? Yeah, we did. We had a, we had a laugh afterwards. Yeah, we did. We got after we it had quite a bit quickly. of mop up. Yeah. Mm. I would say, what's the pubic mound looking like? Yeah. Because this is heavily. It's possibly bad today. I don't... Oh my god. This is a heavy factor as to how quick. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> How quick the cleanup process can be if there's not a lot going on down there. I say brush it away, carry on. Brush. Personally. Ooh. No. Wipe it's it away. With a brush. Baby wipe then. A brush would hurt. Can you imagine someone just gets out a fucking broom? 
That's a broom, not a brush. Okay, sorry, yeah. Um, <laughs> Everyone laugh at that. Oh, God. <laughs> got the wrong one. utensil, idiot. Good one, George. Oh. Um, wow. They're all going to be commenting about they that. Are, they are. Yeah. Everybody comment. Max is so silly for not knowing what a brush is. Mm. Um, silly boy. Um, yeah, just clean up the sick and carry on going. Jobs are good. If someone was giving me a blowjob and they fucking threw up all over you, would you be like, please carry on? I think, I yeah, like I think about it. Anymore. Yeah, true. But you don't know what I'm into, Chloe. I like a city. Sorry, it was really like it yeah. Yeah. I didn't realise you were into You don't know what I'm play. into. I am. Okay, sorry. Um, are we not no. thinking about the health implementations of this? What would you rather, someone throw up on you or if you did anal and they shat on you? Someone threw up on me. Really? Are we yeah. having sex in both of these cuts? Yeah, I know. Right. So, <laughs> so imagine, yeah. imagine somebody wants to make love to you. Just mm -hmm. imagine that for a second. I've been imagining it. Yeah, what would you rather? That one. No, because you would be the shitter. <laughs> no, you wouldn't. I'd be the shitter. Yeah, you have, in this situation, you have be. to receive the anal, unfortunately. <laughs> Chloe's, Chloe's just made the executive decision. Um, I'm sorry, George, yeah. No, you, you would be the shitter, George. Yeah. You thought you had a say in it. You're wrong. Um, wow. Sorry, <laughs> that one. <laughs> In that case, <laughs> on that dilemma, how, how do you recover? Just get over it, brother. There's so if, many if worse things that can happen. If you're in love, um, when a man and a woman love each other very much, they, they can... They throw each other up. <laughs> throw they each they other, throw, throw each, each other, other up. up. <laughs> <laughs> they can... <laughs> throw up on each other's My benefits. boyfriend, my lovely boyfriend Andrew, could vomit from ear to ear all over my lovely That'd be tits. impressive. And I'd probably say, do you know what? I love you still. Um, and maybe do it again sometime. That was quite warm and nice. I've never like, had that type of humour with a boyfriend. I've never pooed yeah. in front of a boy, never fired. I'd honestly rather die. You I have feel, yeah. thrown up on one, though. Oh, I yeah. don't care about sick. Yeah, not voluntarily. <laughs> like, poo's a yeah. bit worse. Yeah, that's different. Sick's that's normal. Different. Poo is a bit worse. Yeah. Kind of my most embarrassing moment of my life was actually on the same fucking holiday. One okay. day I will actually do a story time about this holiday. It's the worst <laughs> holiday I've ever been on. It's in Egypt, so I was 18. And I drank the water. And me and my boyfriend, like, we work, I never fight in front of him, he'll never fight in front of me. As far as we're concerned, bums are not in use. So... <laughs> I have no idea what you just said. <laughs> like, as far as we're concerned, our bums are not in use. Bums are not in use. What my client was trying to say is, as far as we're concerned, my, our bums are not in use. Right, brilliant. Don't Carry poo, on. don't fart. Right. So anyways, I drank the water and I got really ill and we were sat by the... I'm really trying to talk properly now, but yeah, I think yeah. it's because I'm ill, it's making it so a bit worse. So we drank the water and I so shattered everyone in Egypt. We drank the water. Oh, America, no. <laughs> we drank the water down south. <laughs> um, and we were sat by the pool and all of a sudden I knew I was going to shit myself. Oh my God, so I no. just said to him, my mum's calling me, I'm going to the room, do not come up. Do not come up. So I just, just said to him, I'm going to shit myself. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I run up to the room. I actually told this story last night to one of my friends. I run up to the room and I was so, when we were in Egypt, it was like 100 million degrees. It was oh so I hot. And mm. I'd just taken off my whole bikini and I was just naked, like shitting like this. Oh, gosh. And then I all of a sudden was projectile vomiting. Oh, so I was like, oh, there. it's cat, it's coming out of both ends. Oh, Christ. And I, my most embarrassing moment, I look up and my boyfriend's there and he was like, are you okay? Oh. I was like, get the fuck away <laughs> from me, oh, you twat, you oh, twat. Gosh. Isn't it mad how Bad, nice our bodies can look? We can look so well put together. Well, and then, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm speaking on behalf of myself here. <laughs> And then out of nowhere, you can just be shitting out of both ends. So bad. Mm. Wild times. I did a shit in the street once with my first boyfriend. Not what, together? On, no. What? So I... Um, I got a fun first date. Yeah. No, I've told this story before. <laughs> Dreadful times. There's a lovely ditch down the A30. Let's <laughs> yeah. oh, go. Awful. And I hadn't had a poo in like three days and I just knew that I was not okay. And we were going on a night out that night. Yeah. My stomach was out to here. I was in... I, get, I couldn't <coughs> eat anything. Do you need a poo now? No, I'm fine. Wow, I've gained a bit Ooh. of weight. Um, <laughs> wow, fat shaming. Anyway, let's move on. And um, I said to him, like, right, I need to do something. Like, um, So what he had to do was put his hand in no, and no. pull it. No, I'm joking. <laughs> that... Man, your face is dead, Mala. No, no, no. <laughs> his entire hand. It was both hands. It wasn't just, no. Um, get the other one and push on the other end. Oh my god. No, he had to go to the shop and get me laxatives. I told this at our live show. Oh yeah, no, you've told this so many times. Uh, yeah. this story. And um, I, in the process of when he was at the shop, went into like this little medication Tupperware that I had in my room and I found some laxatives. So I yeah. took, it said to take like one, but I took two because I was like, that'll just speed up the yeah, process. Yeah, no one you took three. Yeah, okay. and then he came with some, so I took them as well. Went on the whole night out, I was fine. How many total laxatives had you taken? Probably like three, but they were different brands, so... 
Oh, don't mix brands. No, it was a bit, it was a bit crazy. And I suddenly just felt better. Didn't go to the toilet, nothing, but I felt better. Went on the full night out, everything was good. Went to a takeaway afterwards. My tummy literally just went like, valid day, out of my, <laughs> not even joking, like so fast. And I had to run to my student halls, did not make it. Had to shit in the street, in a bush. And it was like the most humiliating experience ever because I could hear people walking towards me, talking, and I was like, I didn't have any tissue, I had to wipe my ass with a leaf. Yeah. And then I sprinted to my accommodation, shat in the disabled toilet in the common room as well. Like Better it was- Better in your bedroom. Oh yeah, smell. it mm. was dreadful. Went upstairs um, and then he makes it back with his takeaway. He's like, did you make it? I was like, yeah. Everything was fine. What are you on about? I'm yeah. good. I didn't even need the lectures Horrible, in the end. horrible time. Right, on that really smelly, horrible, disgusting night, yes. you just really were bad time. Thank this you. Podcast. Thank I think it's time to play some games. Oh my gosh, okay. you're here. Absolutely. I love games. I imagine you've been on a bit of a losing streak recently. I mean, yeah, that's I've just come kind back of. Um... To claim my title. Hello, welcome to round one. This is called Stop the Waffle. Ooh. Everyone should be familiar with this by now. Basically, you have a lie on your card, or you can tell a truth by yourself. Just tell a story, okay. and I have to guess if you're lying or not, and tell you to stop the fucking waffle. Okay. You guys can go first. Right, you have beautiful eyes, by the way. Thank you very much. That was much. a lie. <laughs> no, I'm joking, it actually. <laughs> no, I was just looking at them, and I thought, what beautiful blue eyes you have, Chloe. Okay, very um, much. Right, so I'll go first. Well then. In college, I wrote Harry Potter, as a musical. Well, I was J.K. Rowling. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Right, next one. Is it you next door? I rewrote Harry Potter as a Christmas musical and cast myself as Voldemort. I feel like you'd be more of a Harry. Okay. And <laughs> um, I can hold my breath underwater for three minutes. Oh, two different stories there that I'm guessing. I'm like, oh, you're. Sorry, I didn't explain the rules very well, did I? You just pick one. What you do pick you mean? one and tell like an elaborate story <clears throat> and I work out if you're guessing or not. Oh, I but thought that we I had to do a truth and a lie. But you're holding the breath and the is a big fat fucking lie. Am I right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what did I do wrong? So, so on the card there's a lie. Yes, right? yes. And you also need to kind of like seal that with a true fact about yourself you deliver them the same like you've just done yeah and then they need to guess which one's true he just told oh, right. two yeah three. i told two no 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 you've got a yeah, choice your story. story or this story and you tell it oh and then if that if you tell your truth brilliant right i'll go and we'll see so you lose that one right okay i lose okay i am voldemort and <laughs> our fish is that one? Wait, you're Voldemort and half fish, did you just say? That's what you I just fucking so. said, Oh, basically. okay, right. I'm sorry, I'm really not. God, I'm I've actually got a good right. one. <clears throat> okay. Basically, I don't know if any of you know, but I used to have a really good job in the city before I fucking quit and became mm. famous as fuck. No, <laughs> just kidding. Anyways, I used to work like for an investment bank and I used to actually pitch to sales teams and I had quite an important job. Mm -hmm. And one day I actually had a meeting with like all the directors of the departments because I was pitching something very important mm -hmm. okay and i'd woken up that morning i'd woken up late and we all used to have to wear like dresses heels like quite formal but weird attire i don't know why i couldn't wear flat shoes mm -hmm. anyway so i've got dressed that morning i've put my tights on i put my dress on and i've gone in really nervous whatever i've got up to stand in front of the room there's probably about 20 old fucking finance men in there i've got up to speak and the lights were like on me and as i've gone to speak they've gone What's that in your tights, sir? I've looked down, I've got yesterday's knickers just in my see-through tights, just sitting there on my leg. And I was like, oh, that's my sock. My sock, <laughs> and they were my lace knickers, dirty knickers from yesterday. Oh my God. Um, what was the story? Any questions? So we, uh, right, okay, so um, what color were the knickers? Pink, lacy pink, Victoria's Secret number. Mm, carry on. Lacy pink. Uh, <laughs> George, put it away. <laughs> Oh my God, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, okay, so did they, what, what, who was it that noticed them? The marketing director. The marketing director, okay, mm. that's quite a generic term. His name uh, was His name was Yeah. That's a weird first name. name. name All oh, right, we have to bleep the name. Interesting. Oh, I can't make the joke then. Um, <laughs> any questions joke, for me? Anyway. Um, honestly, I clocked off with her for the first half because I was trying to figure out how to make my mix. <laughs> wow. <laughs> right, 
brilliant. This game is going so good. I paid full attention. Um, so, what was your what was your <clears throat> pitch about? The digitalization of all the marketing material because they just used to use paper, and I was like, no, let's fucking go online, and I can do that. Okay. I got a degree in marketing. Do you know what? I'm I'm thinking about it, and a lump. I've seen your knickers, and they're fucking huge. Like <laughs> absolutely. I'm talking like sometimes even thigh length. No, so I, I've never. I'm thinking that these sexy knickers. these knickers would be huge and cause quite a significant lump in the leg. I do believe because I remember when I met you that you told me what your job was. <laughs> yes. I do believe that you would have given that sort of speech as well. Um, but I don't believe that the knickers were stuck there. I reckon You'd if, feel if a knicker anything was, was stuck if, there, if knickers were there, yeah. I can't abbreviate that. No, Jesus, sorry. please. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I think that if anything, it was like a sock or something. But I do believe that there was something stuck there. There's a true story. My fucking knickers were oh, in there. I had to go to the bitch. toilet and take them out and do the fucking speech. Oh, that is gross. It's true blue. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, well. At least you would be memorable for them. I don't give a fuck. I hate them all now. <laughs> fuck you, Warren. <laughs> fuck you, Warren. <laughs> okay. So, I was once on holiday and I uh, went under the water and held my breath for three minutes. Who's having a beer? I believe that. I, um, <laughs> I a true story. I was at a house party once. Wait, neither of us understand this game, do we? No, I'll just roll with it, jokes. babes. Right, you carry on going. <laughs> I'm lost, but you carry on. I was at a house party once upon a time. Yeah. Um, What's so funny about that? <laughs> Max's face, he's going <laughs> through it. I've not got a clue what's going on, but I won't, I'm going to go to you. understand. Okay. Silly boy. Okay. I was at a house party once upon a time. Uh, didn't get invited again. No. Bit of a disappointing story, that one. Yeah. Um, no, is that it? But I, Believe no, God. I, thank you. <laughs> yes. um, no, I um, may not have had, may not have been official with anybody, but I have, I've, I've sp spoken to people in the past, really? believe it or not. Oh, wow. Um, Do they well speak done. back or...? Thank you. Uh, no, oh. they're very, fairly you inanimate. Talk at them. They're always very mute, they? yeah. um, <laughs> And the, the girl that I was speaking to at the time, um, we were at the, we was, it was her house party. No. Oh. And we were playing a game of spin that bottle. Oh, okay. I don't believe it. No one fucking plays that. No. You think you used to play that back in the day? How old were you at this party? Yeah. Probably like, when did everyone used to play spin the ball? <laughs> <laughs> Probably like that age. Yeah, <laughs> just just around the time that people were playing spin the ball. <laughs> All the um, cool people. <laughs> um, and <laughs> um, and um, just trying to imagine how this would go. Um, <laughs> And we just we just uh, we were playing spin the bottle, mm -hmm. um, and it very was cool. very much you know those friends that are uh, like their family are very much involved with your friendship groups are like their brothers sisters like you sort of get along they're very where did you family grow up, based. By the way? Hmm? Where did you grow up? Windsor Castle. Um, I grew up in Bristol. <laughs> South Mer Oh Bristol. Yeah. Sorry no Bristol. <laughs> yeah. It's weird round there. Uh, yeah. So, uh, uh, <laughs> Fucking ate it there, mate. Anyway, carry that on. That helps the story. Um, so their, their family were very friendly with all of us. You know, we used to chill with like, their brothers and sisters. Mm -hmm. used to chill with them. We used oh, to hang on! on was it you or Dad? Do you remember? Did you... <laughs> yeah, George got with his dad. George That's the end of the dad. story. Yeah. 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 Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right, it's, it's so it true. isn't like that, Amber. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> and anyway, we're playing Spin the Ball and, and other games as well. Mm. May not have been Spin the Ball, if you don't mm. believe that. Yeah, yeah. Um, and anyway, the, it ended up being, you know, it's sort of just like, kiss this person, kiss that person. And it an, ended up landing on the girl I was speaking to's mm. mother. The man and, wasn't playing spin and I obviously, I obviously <laughs> went, weird. I obviously went, no, this is, this is odd. But Why like, did no one say that to her when she started playing? Yeah. No, that's fucking weird. Yeah, you slag. <laughs> slag, you slag bitch. <laughs> but then... <laughs> But we're all like, we're everyone, you know how everyone is, sort of peer pressure. Yeah. You know how everyone is. Get on, get off of their mum. Of course, yeah. Um, Family Christmas. It peer goes pressure and all that. Yeah. Everyone's like, no, do it, do it. And I was like, no, this is, this is weird. And then her mum was like, oh, just a peck. So she went at that. And then at the last minute, tongue down your throat. Last minute, just whipped my yeah. trousers off and we had full bone sex. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Believe it. Yeah. Mm. True story. Mm. But no, that was. How many people have been in the box? Was dad playing? No, it was just me and the mum. <laughs> 
Pay pressure from her. Like, play it, play it, play it. Nobody else is there. <laughs> uh, no, it was about, I'm going to go with like 12 of us. It like my friend playing. has this like little pod outside his house that fits like just about 12 friends. of us in it. Yeah. yeah, that sounds rich. Wow, okay. Was the dad playing? Uh, no. He looked away. He was, lion. He was lion. busy. He was busy. What was he doing? Just dad things. Probably yeah. divorcing the mum. Yeah, yeah, with yeah I, think he was, I think he was filing papers. Right, so wait. So what are the rules of this game? Do we have to guess whether he's lying? You're on his team. I'm on his team. Back the story up. Right, whoa. Okay, Max, I was there. What I felt so to basically, say, yeah, Max so, was there. Uh, so I was there and oh my God. <laughs> Max is the ex. I can't, even, I can't even tell you how wild this night was. Do you remember that song, How Separate We Can? Yeah. That mm. had just come out. It was the summer of the World Cup. Fairly recent. Oh, World Cups last year. Yeah, yes. there every four years. Um, I mean, the, the other World Cup. It was that summer. The sun was out. Everyone was just on such good Even vibes. Even if it was four yeah. years ago, you're too old to be breaking spin the ball with someone's mom. I was obsessed four years ago, with I was the dad. 19. So that corroborates his story. Corroborates? Well, yeah, because he was with the dad because he is the son. He's actually my ex. Yes. Very attractive mother. <laughs> Thank you. Know. Yeah. Looks so really like him, spinning actually. Spinning plates. Yes. We mm. were spinning plates and spinning bottles. Absolutely. Mm. I um, don't believe one fucking word of this. I'm gonna say it's a big fat lie. You don't believe one word of it. Not even that I have friends. It's a bit rude. Wow. <laughs> wow. Especially that bit. <laughs> I don't believe. Right, Is so it a that... lie? It was a lie. Oh. Oh. Damn it! Another point. George. We're not doing well. You can't get with someone's mum playing oh, spin the ball at a party ten years ago. Oh, for God's sake. Right. I knew I'd win this one. Fucking <laughs> losers. <laughs> at the end of that round. <laughs> I'm 1-0 up, but okay. I was 2-0 up, obviously you get one point. So, how's your lap? Oh, is this the French round? Speak. I'm so good at French. How's Ready? <laughs> Game two, who am I? Each person has a card with a person's name on it. The other person has to ask questions to figure out who they are. Don't you dare start explaining who you are. Person? I'm going to ask you three questions. questions. Okay, if I don't brilliant. get it after the three, you then, then work you. your way down the clues. Right. Which are on your oh, card. Oh, these are the clues. Okay, brilliant. Are me and Max the same person? Check. You two are against me, so it doesn't matter. Oh, can we check? Yeah, check. No, mine's different. Well, then that's just ruined it. <laughs> well, I know. We're, we're, it's two against no. one. Um, right. Yeah, you yeah. two are on the team okay. Okay. versus me. Mm -hmm. Right, I'll guess... George, I'm going to guess you first. Okay. Are you a boy? I am Sorry, not... are you male? I am not a male. Oh, is it on? Are you female. Fucking, I'm assuming. No, that's not <laughs> one of my questions. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> are you famous? Yes. Hit me ambiguous. Yes mm. or no, it's not hard. Mm. Not all. Yeah, maybe. Um, you're famous and you're a girl. Are you really cool? No. Mm. Is that no. all your questions going on? I need then? a clue. Right, so you have to give a clue. The first well, just read it out. Yeah. He knows the rules, he's helping this time. Yeah, see, so I get it. But it's, it's worded as a question. Do I just yeah, my... say the question? <laughs> I think, right, no, let, you let me see what it says. No, you answer the question as you say it. That's to help oh, okay. you give the clue. Oh, okay. So right. I, read, I read the question to myself and then answer it. Okay. Right. Would you ever get involved in influencer boxing? <laughs> I, so do I, oh, I think I would. would. Yeah. I would. You would. She. Oh God! I've revealed she's a girl. <laughs> um, <laughs> she. Hmm. Number one. You know her. Mm. Okay. <laughs> right. That's a good clue. Like... Yeah. That's a really good clue. Yeah. <laughs> Which I don't think you would have guessed if you didn't know them. Um, <laughs> in fairness, that would completely defeat the point yeah, of the game. And they might get into boxing. And maybe they're already, maybe they're already into buy. boxing. Is that, are they? That's another clue. Is that a clue? It's yeah. Albuk. Yes. yes. I was trying to be uh, more vague with the clues. Right, okay. <laughs> so vague, that's not fair. So, guys, I've got a good question. Off I could I ever <laughs> box someone? No, I fucking wouldn't. For love, no, you can fucking pay me to beat someone up. Because they die. <laughs> so you're saying you would never get involved in influencer boxing? Yeah. <laughs> mm. I, I mean, you, you just said that you would. No, I didn't. You did, didn't you? I'm, as L. Brooke. Oh, oh, so you were, yeah, you were method. Wrong. Right, OK. Of course, otherwise, I wouldn't just go, I wouldn't, this person would. Right, OK, just, I understand. Would you, though? 
Would you box me? No. Mm. If my followers saw me box, I think they'd cry. I would fucking watch that. I'd <laughs> fucking watch that. Uh, the only po person that I would box is Liam Payne. Liam, I know that you watch <laughs> Chloe versus the world. All right, he I know what you do. He always comments my shit. He's obsessed with me. Won't leave me alone. So, like, <laughs> what's happening what there? What a pain. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would love that. I would lose. I would so lose any box match. I don't know if you would. Oh, I would. No, you would. No, I would. No, it's I too would. much to lose. Oh, so yeah, you could true. Yeah. Batter him. <laughs> What about you? Who do you I, fight? I don't know if I would fight. I can't, I can't think of anybody that would make sense You're not sense really a fighter, fight. are no, you? No, I'm more of a... Oh, I'm not even a lover. No. I'm just a person. Yeah. <laughs> mm, I just sort of exist. Yeah. Um, I don't know who would be a... a, a make sense as a fight. Mm, I can really. think of some I mean, I, I don't think I'd want to. Just because you, everyone gets so, like, serious Swarms. in it. Ah, oh, deck that little shit. <laughs> no, I... I, I who swarms? <laughs> Big Butter. Uh, it's a oh. rapper. Oh, I'd have him. Rapper turned boxer. I'd absolutely have him. I'd swarm around like him. He actually really is liking my friend's picture at the moment he lives in Australia. I think he's like 5'8", oh, yeah. though. How old are you? Like 6'4", I think. <laughs> no. You can fight <laughs> Liam Reardon, then. Tell that little pussy to come on and you beat him up. <laughs> Oh, I think I'm like six foot instead of that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm. No, yeah, just to clarify, yeah, George is not six foot four. I'd say you're six foot. Mm. I think I, what am I, six, five, ten? No, I'm How no. tall are you? Ticked about two. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking up, <laughs> yeah. me. Liam, I've got my beer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm no, I would cry. Four or five foot five. I'm 165 centimetres. All right, okay. One oh. sec. Yeah. Don't have a fucking clue what that. <laughs> right, one sec. If you carry the four, um, no. <laughs> if I was not to do. Right, okay. Right, yours, any yours. Other how there there? Yeah. Um, how much would you need to be paid to get in the ring? Boxing, oh my god. Not now. Right, okay. Me. Right now. To do to do a one-off match. <laughs> yeah, it's immediately. Get there. <laughs> We've got it set up next door. <laughs> Let's settle it in the ring. Let's have it. Yeah. Um, so I fucking was, I thought you said to your boyfriend, didn't it? Yeah. Would Jen you fight your boyfriend? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, that would be great. No, that would be bad. Oh my you god, would no, I would that. would be great. I would love that. Oh yeah. my god. How much would you have to be paid to fight, Andrew? Fifty quid. No. <laughs> I do it. I've got it ready in my bar. Let me think. Plus. How much should we actually like? Let's think about the yeah, logistics. Yeah. How much? How much would we have to be paid? The to... The logistics of an influencer match. You have to like, like hype it up before. You have to do one of those so things. So much training. Uh, oh, the I would play it where you like face to face, like. No, but if that's oh, not the, that's not the worst oh, bit. It's no, the it training. Is. Oh, Six I couldn't. I wouldn't be training. Yeah, you have something. so much training to I do. I would not be training. Like, all I of just... the people that do boxing don't ever post anything because they're just. I would training. need to be paid oh two mil. Right, two yeah. mil. Do you know what? Yeah. <laughs> Why not? Because I ain't getting fucking work after. I've got no career, so I need two mil to fuck that is around actually, after that's being beaten true. up by so many people. Oh, in that case, five mil. I want five million pounds <laughs> so that I never have to see the face of the earth again after I get twatted by Liam Payne. That's what I want. Ten mil. <laughs> Genuinely, like, yeah, it would need to be, a, or maybe, I don't know, if I could, <laughs> maybe I don't know, if I could literally, if I knew that it would be like brilliant, iconic, and I could know going into it, I'm just going to get to it. That's going into a box of being, This needs to be iconic. <laughs> <laughs> no, I genuinely would want to go in and get knocked out by the first punch, Why and then the be like, "Why the fuck would you want that?" Because that way, I get, I still get all the money. I just so don't I want have to five go through. Million pounds to be knocked out. Yeah, but you also get how, how brilliant is that? You're One punch. You also get concussed. Do you remember when the Kardashians did a boxing match? Oh god, and they actually got clapped. They got absolutely twatted. Yeah, Kardashians. Oh, I'd want it to be like that. I'd want to get absolutely twatted. Right, two mil, five mil, ten mil. Okay, you guess me now. Right, okay. Um, are you a woman? Yes. That's a bit rude. <coughs> <laughs> Have you been on Love Island? No. Ooh. Oh. Not many celebs left, are there? No. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's like everyone that I know. <laughs> yeah, well, takes off a hefty chunk. Um, <laughs> are you... So you're a, you're a, she's a man? No, she's a woman. No, she's not a woman. You said is she a woman, she said no. Are you a man? No, I'm a woman. She's no. a woman. It's a female, yeah. Sorry, it's the oh. Adam's apple. It's confusing. I'm uh, ill. A woman, a woman <laughs> is not on Love Island. Um, are you a, are you, are you a TikToker? No. Right, okay. Yeah. Have we used them all then? Yeah. Right, you give us a clue. They've fallen over on live TV. Gemma Collins. Yes! Oh, incredible. Well done. Incredible. That was good. Love Bye. Island! Yeah! Oh. And, and the dancing on ice. Oh, yeah, yeah, No, sure, stop. Course, yeah. She is my dream guest. Oh, in life. I can imagine. I love yeah. the GC. Would you oh. ever have her on You've your own? Oh, my God. Absolutely. Apparently, you she's... You are having her. I've got you. have got him on, GC. 
Oh, George Clark. Oh, ha ha. Mm. Fuck off, George. Um, I would love to have Gemma Collins on. Mm. I think that she would just be an absolute nightmare and I'd love every second of it. I feel like she'd show up 10 hours late. She wouldn't <laughs> give a fuck. She wouldn't even look us in the eye and I would lap it up. Yeah. I would love it. I've actually, my makeup girl does her makeup. She's really oh, professional. Really? Oh, really? She's, yeah, oh, really, really oh, nice. Really, even better. Love the juicy. Yeah, right yeah. You've got egg in your face now, don't you? I do, actually. It's, it's, I was going to say it's juicy. Who's your dream guest? Oh. I can't imagine it's the same person. No. Oh, my God. Mine, <laughs> no. mine is the entire... Um, entire group of little mix including jesse nelson did you see that this morning yes crazy and i can like host a like reunion with them and be no, like they've guys said they're literally never getting back together this morning yeah yeah oh no they've said that since the beginning like oh. they've not spoke to each other in like two years no one's dead <gasps> oh wait <laughs> that scared me so much that oh my god i don't even know why because i knew that they're not dead <laughs> Oh, but oh yeah. my god! My we basically like... tried to fucking prank you, and it was meant to be one of the dilemmas, but it wasn't written down. I couldn't remember it. Oh, I like, pulled it. I pulled it out. Say little makes a fucking dead. <laughs> Can I? Yeah. That's what I said. I said the way to get you would have been like, if you see what they said this morning, they're getting back together for like a reunion Oh, talk. so that was supposed to be a prank? Yeah. Yeah, no, but so, then you said yeah, so, and I was so, like, no, that was what I said. Because I said, if, they, if you say, if we said to you, oh, they're getting back together for like a reunion tour, you I would have lost my shit. No way. Yeah. Fuck off. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay. See, I didn't. I didn't see, you can see how, how gullible yours was. You literally went, you went, you went yeah. <laughs> 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 one's dead. I really <laughs> believed you then. I was like, who? I was like, most of them have kids. I'll sob, I'll sob. Oh, Everyone knows if you've got so kids. So your dream. Yeah, like all of them. And I need, I want to know what happens start to finish. That's my dream. But go on, watch yours. Our dream. I love Little Mix. <laughs> oh, good. We have very um, different aspirations. I don't know who my, my dream guest would be. Boring answer that Yeah, one. that's a bit shit, innit? Um, fuck it, George Clark, the architect. Who's that? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what? He comes, oh, I thought he, he would be he... good with Louis Theroux. Yeah. yeah. Similar vibes. No, yeah, I, I, love, I love, like a bit of Louis. Mm. I could, I could would deal be with good Louis. To get on. Mm. Yeah. The side men, you like the side men a lot. They would do it. If he said dream guest. Oh, okay. Right, he hates um, the side men. Oh, you hate him. them. Yeah. Okay, so we have nightmare guests then, <laughs> the side men. We, um, what was I going to say? Oh, oh, I, I, when you said Louis Theroux, for some reason I thought of a Ross that I did of George on the thing where I said, he looks like a mixture of Will from the Inbetweeners and Mr. Tumnus from Narnia. And I thought, oh, that, I is, it, that is so Tumnus. accurate, isn't it? It's so accurate. You don't look like mm. Will, you sound like Will. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. like, if they combined, I feel like it would look a bit like George. I don't know why yeah. Louis III made me what think of that. those things Sorry, that are uh, half horse, half human? Centaur. Centaur, yeah. That when was we were... so weirdly off the sound. Centaur! <laughs> Centaur! Come on, Win. Oh, yeah, when, when we were, oh, yeah, sorry. No, when we were going... <laughs> sorry, we need to hear about when Centaur. We were, in, uh, we were in Dubai shooting for Chris um, and Arthur TV. Shooting for what? Chris, for Chris. Jesus, Jesus Christ. Christopher Michael Dixon. He calls Dixon. him Chris. Christ. Yeah. Okay. It's a short little man who likes football. Okay. Um, okay. We Chris MD? Yeah. No, that is. Yeah. Um, and uh, one of the people here. we're with. Yeah, yeah. Do you want to know any more buzz, buzzwords about Chris? <laughs> Football. <laughs> sure. <laughs> YouTube. Um, so we were, we were there, and one of the people said that it, I looked like a centaur that became a human again. So, so accurate. So accurate. It's really quite rude, yeah. but I could like, also see it. Do you walk it. weird? Hmm? Do you walk weird? Well, he, has, trot. he has four yeah, legs. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> Um, right, is your card, Mr. Thomas? Right, okay, I'm ready. If I get this, you lose, you fucking bitch. Right. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> whoa. Whoa, I'm not your mum, alright? Don't speak to me with that rude tone. Jesus. Press conference ready. <laughs> <laughs> right, go on. Ask me a question. I'm sorry, go on. <laughs> <laughs> Are you on Love Island? No. From Love Island? No. No, that wasn't two, that was one. <laughs> <laughs> no Love Island? No. Well, three, questions. three questions. <laughs> <laughs> you definitely not on Love Island. Uh, oh, you're not. I'll no. give you a clue. She's not on Love Island. <laughs> They're not. She's a girl. Why Yay! did you do that? I was oh, well. talking about Are you a girl? <laughs> no, um, I get this a lot, but no, I am a man. I'm confused. No, it is a girl. It's, it's a girl. girl. Yeah. TikToker. Yes. Did you get Barry? Yeah. Oh, oh boo. It's so easy. That boo. was six questions, though. <laughs> <laughs> I got it one. Right, here it says, Max and Grace just went to Ibiza together. Any crazy stories? Well... Yeah, actually. <laughs> no, <laughs> next one. <laughs> we, um, on the first night, did you see the clip of Grace in the fountain? Oh, the my gosh, yes. So I... Bless her. I loved it because... 
everybody <coughs> literally thought all the comments were like oh max is so sweet look at him diving in together like and joe literally came down the next morning and he was like max i am basically your pr person like i've just done you a massive favor because everyone thinks that you're this saying you joe's mom your end. i well i didn't push her in. <laughs> I didn't push it. Away. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. So we were all very drunk after this bar that we'd been to. And for whatever reason, me and Grace decided to run off ahead of everyone. And we were like, let's just let's see how fast we... I think we were having a race. I have no idea. And then I saw the fountain. I went, oh, should we go in the fountain? I was like, that'll be such like a puddle experience. Like, what's it called? Paddling even. That'll so be such a puddle they're experience. They're yes. <laughs> that was a weird way to say that. <laughs> such a fun paddling experience. I was like, oh, that'll be great. So we dart towards this fountain and I get there and I'm like, right, I'll take my shoes off because I just got new trainers. I was like, I'll I was about to take my trousers off. Grace literally didn't have any shoes on. So she went straight in and it was just a lot deeper than we anticipated. Hi. And Hi. She, it, no joke, it went like up to our hips. So Grace went in, in a dress, and she completely slipped because it was so deep, went underwater. So at that point, I jumped in with my shoes and my trousers uh, on together. So I was a bit of a oh, hero. You did help I was a bit of a hero. It? Yeah. Um, but yeah, so the, the intent was to cause absolute mayhem and just have a fun time in the fountain it came off like I'm a hero and I stopped Grace from like trying to kill herself. So either way, you know, I I, I did well. So well done me. Did she get ill after that? Because you look cold. I, I mean, like, we, funny, but yeah, fuck it Grace out. doesn't handle like the thing with Grace. Everyone thinks that like she's like hardcore out every night. Yeah. She got twatted on that first night, but then she's like, I literally can't do it again. Like she's sim and I'm getting to that point as well. I like, am there. So like, I, so when um, Charlie posted this video of us all, and it was like the day after Ibiza or something, or like the day that we were going home. And everyone was like, Grace looks so hungover. And I was like, she didn't even drink the night before. That is, oh, that is rude. No. I was like, bless her, that is awful. Do you know though, don't you find the older you get, the longer hangovers take? Like oh, mine are four days minimum. I felt dreadful. Yeah. The fact that me and Joel got absolutely twatted on that last night, and I wanted to do nothing less. Like genuinely, I just wanted to stay in, go to bed, eat food, not have to do it. So like, yeah, we are the dickheads really, but. I don't get hungover. Fuck off. Mm. You don't you drink enough have. then. Yeah. No, but like people say this, but like, I, like you've seen You don't me, like, drink fuck. that much. No, but you've seen me like fucked. And I've I'm, seen like, him very drunk I'm, like, once. But I was like fine the next day. Like, and I'm... no, actually you weren't because the one time I've seen you really drunk, we did some up with Sports Direct. Oh yeah, and but that was because that was my alarm Everybody had to wait for, I'm talking about, you have about 50 influencers, maybe even for more, all in vans yeah. waiting and we can't leave until everybody's there. I ring George about half an hour after we're all supposed to be there and I'm like, George, where are you? And he goes, fuck. He's not even woke up because he was out. And I saw him the night before. That was the only time I've ever seen you properly drunk. Mm. So yeah, no wonder your alarm didn't go off because you were absolutely twatted. So that my counts. alarm was drunk. And you looked, <laughs> shut up. What do you mean no wonder your alarm didn't go because off? Because you didn't say it because you were so I drunk. I did say it. Well, even worse than you slept through it. How'd you sleep through an it alarm? It didn't Obviously. go off. Hence my oh, alarm right. didn't go okay, off. Okay, so it's not the fact that George was incredibly drunk and didn't set his alarm. It's the fact that Apple for that actually, one time failed. I actually, okay. took, I actually took it up to uh, the people that worked for Sports Direct and went, look, I'll show you it didn't go off. And they go, okay, we'll reset it so it goes off in a minute. Went off, They set it so it went to a minute and then it didn't go off again. Lies. So, Liza Minnelli. Yeah, Lies. Liza Minnelli. Yeah, I disagree one. with you. He's, he's a fraud. Did I get that point then? <laughs> I don't know what's I going did. on. Uh -huh. You won. Oh yeah, shit. What uh, the fuck? Oh. Right, at the end this of that is round, not on. I'm a winner. However, you're in luck because the last round is double points. Yay. Yay. So we can, can we can win. We so. can draw. We can draw. Okay. All right, everyone. We are now going to play this or that. Okay. The game where you literally have no choice. This or that or. That is some Death. choice. Yeah. So, oh uh, yeah, fuck off. I hate a smart ass. No one likes a smart ass. My phone Whoa. Like I'm just stretched. <laughs> I've been brought to this day. Right. Number one. George must tell us who his worst podcast guest is, or Max must reveal the worst lie he's ever told someone. But I can't do the podcast. You have to I'm say the lie. I'm trying to think lie. who even there is that we've had a bad podcast guest. I don't think we've ever had a bad one. No. Chloe was quite shit. Uh, that's just because we don't like her, though, I isn't literally it? got you so confused. Um, <laughs> just thank me. Yeah, but we don't like her as a person, so... Thank like um, I'm um, going to get up our... I'm really trying to think what, of, a, see of a lie that I've told. Let me think. There must be something. Have you ever said someone's died? 
have I ever said that someone's yeah, died? Like work, work I said my oh, nan's died a week off. One hundred percent. When I used to work at this travel vaccine company, company yeah. which I mean in itself does not sound like a very entertaining job because it wasn't. <laughs> um, I oh my god, when I got this full on internship, I told them oh, this is quite brutal. Really. Okay, there we go. I got this internship Bring throughout summer way. in so London, dick. and um, I found out that this bitch who I worked with didn't work on Fridays because she basically did... Oh, fuck off! I probably have the same situation. Right. Well, she didn't work on Fridays because she was doing her master's at the same time, so Not she had time. to go into uni. So I made up a lie that the person that I was living with was, like, an elderly relative, and I had to look after them and, like... Fairs. And um, so I got out of working every single Friday for the whole summer of that internship. Oh, that's a good lie. Yeah, but it was quite bad because I, I felt like, oh, my God, am I jinxing that someone's going to need looking after in my family? But they're all all right. They're all still kicking. Um, nice. And I didn't have to work Fridays. Family so football. Okay, that yeah. was like a good it. one. Yeah, right, what's yours? I'll read it out. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> Um, so Chloe must reveal a juicy secret someone has told her recently, don't need to say who, or pick her favourite out of George and Max. I actually said Max and George, but you yeah, me first. I just cute. wanted to have mine last in the brain for memory. Oh, wow, well, I feel bad. Oh, juicy you? secret that someone's um, told wow, me. Okay, don't have to say who. Yeah. So has Millie told you any secrets that you kept? No, well, no. If she then goes, oh yeah, I'll use that one, but I won't say who. <laughs> no. Are you sure she's not told you anything? She's see, got no Nothing comes to mind. No. No secrets for Millie. That's so crazy. Chloe, what's your yeah. paper? Guys, I'm stuck. <laughs> 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 You're my favourite. You're my favourite. You're my favourite. It's going to give me 10 million after this stuff. Whoever the fuck is going to be up. Right. Right, okay. We'll I'll go. go. Oh, it's ours next. Okay. George, you must tell us the rudest YouTuber or TikToker you've ever met, or Max must tell us the rudest YouTuber or TikToker he's ever met. Oh. Who's got the rudest, or... I don't know, I haven't really come across any rude ones. Yeah, you have. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> look into my eyes. Into my eyes, look into my eyes. We both know one that you could say, but you're not going to say it. No. And I don't think you should say it. So at the end of that, no one said anything. Yeah, so I don't, I don't have a name that, that I can give you. Um, I'll be getting a point. You get a point. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay. We're not doing well, George. Uh, what's my no. next one? All right. Um, yeah, go on. Next. Number two. God, it doesn't feel right coming out of my mouth, this one. <laughs> Send a bikini pic to your crush or confess one embarrass or, oh, or confess one embarrassing story from Ibiza. I bizarre. I beat her. I beat her. Please send a bikini picture. Who's your crush first of all? I'm not saying it. Go on. Oh, I'll let you do it. I'll do it. But yeah. I won't fucking name and shame them, but right, I'll get your guys' though? reaction. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> this is great. <laughs> Just waiting for it to come through. <laughs> I'm just deleting my two recent messages because I'm embarrassed. I'm going to send the picture what are you and then I'll show on? you who it is. Okay. What are you sending it on, Chloe? <laughs> He's waiting for the message. <laughs> <laughs> this seems a bit unhinged, actually. <laughs> do it, do it. <laughs> they're at work. Well, they're working. Also, oh, they have a job. That's always good. Yeah, they're on a podcast, aren't they? Mm. I need a bikini picture that I've not sent them. <laughs> <laughs> I need a pussy pic that I've not already sent. <laughs> I can show you. Right, okay, okay. you. Shut the <laughs> fuck up. Chloe, what is going on? Chloe, what is going on? <laughs> Chloe! How is this happening? <laughs> oh my God, Chloe, what is happening right now? I need to speak to you so much right now. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, oh. Also, that's my old number. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Damn it. Chloe Burrows, what is happening? Oh my God, I can't cope with this. <laughs> What's I knew that would be funny. I knew that would be funny. Oh, I want to say so much, but I don't want to give it away for your sake. Allude. Allude. Be careful what you fucking yeah, say. Yeah, well, there you go. How can I allude without saying, um, <laughs> just say, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> I, need, I need information right now. I just think there's something in the water. Well, of course you bloody do. <laughs> Yeah, it might make you throw up. Yeah. I'm <laughs> really annoyed, look. Don't worry, George. The <laughs> thing to lead you on. Oh, God. Right, OK. There's a Taylor Swift lyric. Go on, then. Um, he wears shorts. He no. doesn't wear shorts, guys. I she... think I've seen this scene before. And, and I didn't, didn't like the ending. ending. Oh, oh no, that's not even the right lyrics. The Swifties are going to come after me. Film but, yeah, before. Film before. Yeah. Oh, God. All right, moving on. I'm upset. <laughs> 
Oh, yeah. no. I'm not. I'm just <laughs> shut up. I'm shut up. Gotcha. <laughs> Got me. Gotcha, bitch. <laughs> oh, Christ. This okay. is funny. Yeah. Funny, why not? Fuck about. Why Run not? Your life. Why not? Move yeah. to any Devon. <laughs> oh, I need to grow up. <laughs> right. Chloe chooses for George or Chloe chooses for Max? Chooses what? Just a full Your fit. Your punishment. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. Sure. <clears throat> no, you guys choose. Oh. This what? or that. It just says Chloe chooses. Oh, well, either you or you take the hit. It's either I choose for George or I choose for you. Oh, I thought you give well, us you options for decide. both and then we choose. No. You find out afterwards. Oh, okay. Oh, right. no. This game is very confusing. <laughs> wait, so we <laughs> wait. We find out what? You? We find out if it's to me or George. No, yeah. you fucking pick. Yeah, and then so we I'll just say if it's me or me or you, and then right, I'll do it then. Do you want me to take the hit? Frank or Andrew? Take the okay. Hit. And Easy. say 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 I need to talk to you for a minute. So cheese, cheese, The Daily cheese. Mail is running a story about me and a girl and I just need to get ahead oh, yeah. of it. Should I say a, an, another boy? Because he won't believe okay, that it's Okay, another girl. boy. He won't believe it. He knows I'm deeply homosexual. Like cruel. Don't say that. What shall I say? Right. Say, okay, say, say the Daily Mail has got hold of are you two ever sent some pictures. Uh, of your of two pictures. Of me and pictures. Ibiza. No, no. Was it in Ibiza? Naked pictures of you. Me. Have you ever sent them to Andrew? Naked pictures of me. Be like, oh my, my God, number got leaked and somehow they've like... Right, 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 okay. Got... Yeah, yeah, your oh iCloud's been hacked! Oh my your God, this, been this hacked. is brilliant. He's yes. going to believe it, you know. Okay. Please answer, please Hi. Hi, you okay? Yeah, I'm okay, you? Yeah, I've just finished doing um, Chloe's... Oh, <laughs> my leg day, sorry. <laughs> sorry, my brain's literally all over the place. I've just finished doing Chloe's podcast. Katie yeah. has just messaged me saying that there's nude pictures of me that have been leaked to the Daily Mirror. And um, literally from like Grinder or something back in the day, she sent it to me. I'm having a literal panic attack. I've just, what? I know she's saying that they're threatening to release it unless we paid them money. And I'm like, do I just do that? But then they'll still have the pictures and they could just release it. Andrew, I literally don't know what to do. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up, they've, they've, wait, the Daily Mirror have them? They have the pictures of me. Okay, right, are they? Wait, but how can they release them? They, the Daily Mirror can't print, like, nude photos. They said that they're going to... They have, like, other... It's basically, like, I think the Daily Mirror are a bigger company or something, and they've got, like, other news sources that they're going to put it out to on the internet. I don't know, like... They've basically said, like, we now own these, and if you want to buy the rights of them from us, then you can. But I'm so worried. Okay. It's okay. Don't, don't worry. I'm literally so worried, Andrew. No, stop. I feel bad. I feel bad. I feel right, bad. Andrew, sorry. sorry. <laughs> sorry. Oh, sorry. my God. That's, that's a prank. It's a prank. It's funny for about a minute, and then I felt really bad. Oh, God, that was awful. Andrew, you're far too kind. Oh, my God, you're so nice. Oh, but I'm sorry, sorry. Andrew. Sorry. I should have known. <laughs> Andrew, I'm busting it down yeah. on the internet right now. <laughs> what, I was going to say, I'll make already new photos of you out on the internet. Fucking <laughs> 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 hope not. Should we make some? Yeah, let's do it. Let's, let's do it. Yeah, we'll print, yeah, we'll print oh some God. later. My heart, I thought you were actually crying. Oh, <laughs> I feel really fucking bad. I'm getting bad cards. Oh, right you feel that bad? You're off a minute ago, go. I'm going to do this on this video to be watching. You can do it. Clive was like, I feel really bad. I often do that when I'm sad. Should have seen it at my nan's funeral. People are like really technical, and I just wanted you to be like, yeah, and those wanking videos. And I'm like, what? <laughs> oh, that was great. All right, Clive, and then. Go, what's my last one? Right, right. right okay. either one for you, <coughs> or you can also do one for you. Right, okay, yeah, so we basically one choose a forfeit. Me. The, when you've done, obviously when you get pictures taken of you, like everyone like, does loads, mm. can you find the worst of the batch, of like two batches, and put them next to each other and say which one shall I post? Oh, God, okay. <laughs> <laughs> or or um, <laughs> face tune. Oh, ones that you actually oh, hate. Can face I face tune one? Yeah, yeah. we face yes? tune one. Yeah. And um, then just post it and not say anything. Like, oh, guys, like, which, which one shall I post? <laughs> and then let us just face tune it. I, I will do like very slight things that make it look like it's real, but we just I actually took off. selfies this morning. There we so go, then, brilliant. Do brilliant. Those too. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Please pass it here right now. We'll oh, just my God. enlarge part. Parts will distort. Yeah. Oh, face like tune this. or face that, face tune? Face tune. <laughs> <laughs> what have you actually done to it? <laughs> <laughs> no, but you can tell it just doesn't look right. Okay. Mm. That's the idea. 
Right, the post did it, you <laughs> little weirdos. <laughs> However, at the end of that round, I still won. Oh, it doesn't feel like you won. And I yeah. double pointed. I think we're all losers here, let's be honest. Mm. I don't feel, I feel like myself. a loser. But do you know what that means? What? Well, forfeit for you two. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, Thank you for is. coming. I'm Thank fucking you, losing. <laughs> I expected that. <laughs> I'm now going to spin this. I might spin it twice because there's two of you. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <I'm sorry. laughs> right, ready? Oh this one's for George. This one's for George. Show us the last photo you've taken. Oh, it's just... It's a, I had to send impressions over to my manager, so it's just... Oh, <laughs> it's a, spin it again. It's, it's Show us your again. recent Google search. That's better. Yeah. Okay. I decide. Fuck this, Will. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's me typing our little mix still together to try, <laughs> <laughs> to try, to try and, try and uh, get Max. Are being serious? That was a good that? one. Wild. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> Max, are you ready? Yeah, I was born ready. Oh, you yeah. yeah. get going, man. Oh no! Remove this off the wheel. I say every time. Take, take a, a shot. shot. Oh, take a shot. No. Take a shot. Did yeah, you I say? Take a shot. Shit yourself. <laughs> hot sauce. Of hot sauce. All right then. Yeah. Is it actually spicy? I mean, that is that a stupid question. No, it's cold sauce. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. I'll just put you on the board first. Did you just yeah. believe her sarcasm? Yeah. Never you mind. go, you big fat fucking losers. Thank you. Wow, well, thanks. To be Bobby. fair, TikTokers don't do very well on this no. pod. No. <laughs> Neither do you, sir. How fucking does that? I can't be asked <laughs> to pick that up. Oh, bless us. They actually don't. Someone needs to come in here and see what. Love Islanders are quite good. Oh, oh my god, I put you on the That's wrong side. That's before. not where the losers go. <laughs> there you go. Sorry. I feel like Thanos. <laughs> <laughs> More like funny ass. All these fucking Whoa, losers. Fishy. Whoa, fishy. Whoa, <laughs> fishy. Finish. Oh, God. Just get you a little shorty shop shop. Yeah, let's do little. Let's do it. I don't oh, know. If I this just is know you're awful with yeah, spice. I'm not gonna... Oh, okay. We can calm down now. Oh. We can stop now. Hi. Oh, my God. Right. I'm no, not on the I might spontaneously shit my pants. I hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you're listening, give me five stars and just finish it off, honey. Shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I smell that. Oh, I can smell that. It's a bit spicy. Oh, oh, oh. I'm having a horrible time. <laughs> okay. Oh. I'm trying to chase her. Oh, none left. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'll have that. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my God. You'd be so... <laughs> Shake it. <laughs> <laughs> Anything we wouldn't be able to tell that. Was yeah, no, you did that really well, really well. Anyways, it's been a pleasure. And don't worry, nobody's going to see that. It's not going on the internet. Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> I feel really bad. <gasps> oh, to terrorise you and your boyfriend. I know. To see it. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. Thank you. You okay now? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that was horrible. That was, that's a wrap. Is it hot? Oh, yeah, it's spicy. Well done, honey. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you, Thank you for having us. 